Uh, I'm from Finland. Uh, this is my ninth Globetrotters camp, third as a teacher. Uh, today's topic is going to be attacks from the shoulder front. Uh, one hour is going to go really fast, so I think we're going to start right away. Where's my open? So, just like, be close enough. I have a loud voice, but... Don't block just... Benny. Don't block Benny. <laughs> <laughs> Don't block Benny. So, today we are going to start from close guard. That's the place I have been playing my attacks from shoulder crunch. Uh, I don't want to say you too much, but just to show you what a shoulder crunch is, if you don't know, I think most of you guys know. I come up, I hook the shoulder, I come down, and I try to keep my opponent here. Uh, I want you guys to take a pair and just explore what do you have to do to be able to maintain this control. You can try to get up like yeah, it was bad. And then you go again, and then you try. It's getting better. You just be a close guard. Don't do anything else. Just for a few minutes. Okay. One, two. Let's go. It looked kind of good. <laughs> a couple of things you want to do. When you come up and have the shoulder, I really want to uh, make the pressure here on the back of her shoulder. Do a little like rotating thing. Because if I just pull here, go up, it's easier. But when I do the rotation and I'm crunching all the way through, I'm rotating, it's so much harder. Uh, usually, Larissa don't want me to have the arm. So this is not easy. If I want to have the arm and I'm here, I usually go like the head winch lock, and then I'm just like really mean and let it slide. And I'm here. Yeah. Next thing I want to do, I want to bring my leg on the ground, do a little bit of hip escape, and bring my leg here. And this is really crucial. You really want to like push and pull. I'm making really big stretch here. Does it feel nice? Oh, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. And this is quite good control. I'm not like, this leg I don't mind so much. We can go and try it fast. No, she's not going like anywhere as long as I can keep this like pressure there. So try this out and never let go like the pressure. Okay. One, two. <laughs> two things. The grip. There's not just one way to do it, but for me, I feel when I do the cable grip like this, I really get the pressure and the rotation here that it's really tight. Yeah, so that's why I'm using this. That's the best way. Yeah. Are you saying as opposed to having the hands the other direction? Is yeah. That yeah. yeah, I, I can't it isn't that strong. And I have my hip, no, no hip, hand bone, like a <laughs> wrist bone here. I really can bring it like there in the back of the shoulder. So it, it's quite tight. Yes. So, do you have any questions? No, not this far. So when we are here, I just like, I wanna crunch the hand, do the rotation. Uh, somebody asked, can I bring my leg straight here? Yes, I can. But if it doesn't feel right, you can do the hip escape and bring it here. 
first submission, it not, it's not like high percentage, but you can, and I, I saw that a few guys did it already. You can just slide a little bit away and then go there, like on lock, but you have to see where the joint is to know where to do the submission. I see that the elbow is here, so I'm pressing down and lifting my head just to get it. And at the same time, I'm using my, my leg to keep the distance. If I don't have this, you can escape. You can just like keep that on. Yeah. So, one more time. You get your shoulder crunch. You place your leg to your opponent's hip. Create the distance and slide, be careful, slide, and see where the joint is. If I just pull here, no, there's no submission. But when I bring it here, it comes. Okay, let's try this. One, two. I'm more afraid of the bar. How was it? Good. Huh? It's good. Yeah, you just have to make it like 8,000 times, <laughs> then it gets easier. Okay, but actually it opens up different things you can do. So, when we are here, and sometimes I just, I don't get it. It doesn't just work. What I can do, I can use this leg and shrimp other way around. Maybe Larissa wants to do something about my leg and I just bring it over yeah. and go for a triangle or wrist lock. Or... <laughs> yeah. So it's quite easy, but often people doesn't do the shrimping, right? So when you are here, you really want to move to the other side and keep the pressure. Sometimes Larissa don't want to like give the space and I can't do the triangle, but usually she tries to do something that I have a little bit space here to do the movement again. So I go first here and then all the way through to get the angle, angle here. And then you can submit here or here or whatever you want. Let's try. One, two. I will show you, I, I go back a little bit and show you one thing which is quite crucial to get the first submission done. I apologize, my teaching, I should have said it maybe even like better, but when I come here, look, uh, many of you were like here doing the submission. It's not going to work from here. You really have to come up here. Have the shoulder, like you already see the like crunching here. So it makes it easier for me to submit here. Yes. <laughs> this is like three, you know, poster, so <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. But let's continue. So you're here. The triangle doesn't work. What you can do is to bring your leg here towards uh, your opponent's like yeah. neck. Thank you. <laughs> but you really don't want her to be able to control your ankle because, yeah, this is not nice. I have to do something to release it. So I have to be sneaky. I bring it here. Oh, sorry. And then I push away. If I see that the hand is slipping, I can take control of the tricep here. Like, nice control. And I'm still, like, crunching all the way. I'm gonna do, like, this rotating thing and push her away that I can bring my leg here and the armpit 
and this leg is here all the time making like, like pushing away and usually I can do the submission here already Kimura or just like arm bar or wrist lock if she has like one way to escape here because I'm doing the pulling and pushing where would you go yes but I have like the arm here as well so that's what we're going to try next one more time or <laughs> so everything's same come up and this time create the space move the leg and then here or here and there's different kind of submissions you can do from there. Okay. Are you hoping to get her left foot under her thigh? Yes. Yes. Uh, her left where? Foot under her thigh. When you, when you, when you brought it all the way over, you stuck it under her yeah. thigh. We're... Probably. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Let's write this out. One, two. One more thing, uh, this class is all levels, so if you are a beginner, you may ha um, want to do just the things we did before, because I think there's plenty of things for one class, but I really want to show you one more thing, but before we go there, I want to just uh, show you one detail. Uh, of the last, last submission, the toy bar. Uh, many of you asked, how can I get the, you know, the, the other foot here? And, okay, I like do it a little bit more than I uh, do, but usually it might be that I have to change the grip here, just like to isolate the arm, but I really do shrimp, like maybe this far. And now I have the space mm -hmm. to go. I don't want to go like she can grab my ankle, but I really can go quite far because I have the push and pull and it isn't easy for her to be here. I can control quite well. So then I can move the feet here and then I have the isolated the arm and the submission there. Okay, but let's continue. We can continue from here. Sometimes Larissa is smart and she will uh, start to defend. Do the, the first one you did before, like, no, 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 no. Sorry, I'm a bad instructor. <laughs> no, the, the, no, 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 no. <laughs> the, the first, um, the first, like, defend, like the first one you did with the leg. Because this is quite common. But if I have this leg here, it's quite easy to break. So this doesn't help that much. But sometimes, so you kind of have to do the second one here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to change my hand to my thigh. Then I bring my other leg, push her down and just... Oh, yeah. oh. <laughs> here. And people tend to do this. I don't like to do it because I want to keep her poster and head down from this. Uh, most of times I don't have to do anything. But if she just wants to be here, I may go and just help a little bit from here. And then I place my leg and... Oh, yes. Yes, yes, it comes over. <laughs> so let's do it again. It's quite easy when you have done all the other things we did today. So we're here. And if you feel that you're losing the hand, just like grab the tricep here and keep pushing. Bring the leg. And now she's defending. 
yes, not work. Then I usually bring my like uh, hamstrings here to create the distance. And then it's not easy for her to stay there. I change my hand. Then I, this is the first time I let go of the hip. And I really want to point the sole of my feet towards the ceiling. If it's not possible, just like try to wiggle and move a little bit. And then when she comes back, here. Uh, the thing why I want to keep my other leg also near to just defend here is if I do this and now I'm usually here. So can I can we <laughs> Wow <laughs> When I keep it here and now <laughs> so it comes like it doesn't stick there on the back. Okay, do you need what's more or? Perfect. Okay, one, two. Maybe I don't know what we're doing. Yeah, like grab, right? Like as if you were gonna lock up your own arm. Yeah. And then. Was the Tariko Plata hard? It is a little bit, but the main thing is, like, I noticed two things. Uh, there were quite many times that you kind of did the uh, defending here. So there's no, like, tariko plata here. It's just like breaking the grip. She has to do this. So now I can do the tariko plata, change. And the other thing, which really is hard, I know, you have to keep this tight. Because if you don't do it, the hand will escape at some point. The other thing I, I saw quite much is this leg goes like this. And yeah, it's, it's not good. So, can you do it? Perfect. So what, that, and that's why I don't do this either. It, it isn't wrong, but I have noticed that it's better for me to do like, I don't know the word, but I, I will show you. So when you go, I just like do this and I'm here. I have to keep the hand here. I post my other hand. Oh, this is not easy, but come up Yoga. and then place here. And the other thing, if it doesn't come here, look where I want to go. I want to rotate. Yeah, it comes already, but I, I want to do like this kind of rotation. We have like a few minutes, two minutes, do all the things we did today. <laughs> okay, then quick picture, but like two minutes, do everything. Yes, one, two.